Hey, what's going on, guys? I I uh, just finished doing my scatter plot tutorial with the GraphView library, and I decided since I've already got everything open and I just made one that was very similar, I might as well do uh, the on data point tap listener. So I'm going to show you how to do make it so that you click the points and it will display uh, the x and the y coordinate, and it also will uh, give it like a little red outlining. So what's the first thing we need to do? We need to create another series for the on-click data points because what we're actually going to do is that red you see is actually another data point that I'm putting on the graph but I'm putting it with a, a radius that's slightly larger so it looks like it's outlining it but really it's just getting put behind the blue the blue dot now we're gonna declare a new series uh, I can just put it in here uh, well actually I can put it in here. Now, this is another kind of finicky thing about this this library. If we add series in the wrong order, it will cause the app to crash. So, what I'm going to do to work around it is I'm going to create, I'm going to uh, make the x y value array global, and I'm going to move all the x y value array stuff up into the onCreate method so that it only gets called once. So, I'm going to grab. So, I'm going to delete this so it makes it global and then I'm going to move all this stuff up here oops that was bad up there and I'm gonna also grab this for loop populating the XY series and I'm gonna put it just below here and that should be good. Now we're ready to create our on click listener. So we go on click series dot set on data point tap listener and then new on data point tap listener. I want the log to show that you clicked a data point, so we're gonna log the data point click. It'll just spit out X and Y. And actually we're gonna grab the on click series here and I'm gonna put it I think I can get away with putting it inside here. Then we're gonna append our new data point. So we're just appending the data point that's clicked, and uh, I'm going to put a larger radius on it. We'll set the shape to a rectangle. We'll set the size to red or the color to red. And now for setting the size, uh, we know that the XY series has a size of 20, so we're going to make it slightly larger. You get a size of 25. Then, because this library is very finicky, we want to remove all the series. So we'll do scatter plot, remove all the series and then we're going to add back in the series. So first I'm going to add our on click series. And oh, I almost forgot. I'm going to put a a toast. I'm going to create a little t custom toast method down here. So this is just going to take a message output and output it as a toast or a message input, sorry, and output it as a toast. There we go. So that'll display our x and y. And then finally we'll create the scatter plot again. And that should so we'll click it'll click something and then it's gonna add a new series with a different color and a different size. Or it'll sorry, it'll set the properties to that series, then it's gonna remove all the series and then add them all back and create scatter plot, which will execute this, and uh, scatter and XY series will get added again. I know this sounds stupid, but this li library is very finicky. It's if you add things in the wrong order, it just crashes your app. Oh, see like that. Now let's see what's wrong. It actually didn't even give me an error there. I'm going to just try rebuilding. Oh, I see what it is. This. XY series needs to be declared up here. That should be good. Crashed again. Oh. <laughs> I put the on-click listener to... Uh, that's the wrong series. This has got to be XY series. There we go. All right, well, that's a weird distribution. Hmm. It almost doesn't look random, but it is. I know in this video I kind of jumped around, but hopefully I showed you the gist of it and you understand how to uh, stick an on-click listener on here and highlight a point. If the video was helpful, don't forget to like it, subscribe if you haven't subscribed already, and thanks for watching.